You know, um, this this is our first, as being the first Sunday of the, of the year, or like the first Sunday of the month is our is our mission Sunday. And, you know, one of the things about this church is is that we we have a strong emphasis, a strong commitment to the mission field. And I just um, I just really want to encourage you. The things that we've sown over the years is just God just blesses that, you know. And, and so I've not long come back from Thailand and. If I can say this, it's been a fairly tough year for, for Thailand. It's been a tough year for some of the staff. We, we had some staff over there that were creating some some, some issues. But, but you know how God turns all things for good? You know that? And um, one of the things that's really been so exciting for me to watch is the way Orain and Kono have risen this year. And God has really graced them to overcome. And, and so we've just seen some amazing stuff. So I just want to encourage you this year is going to be a year of transition for us in Thailand. We're going to be moving into some new areas. We feel like, you know, Orang Kainu have stepped into leadership as of as of last year. And, and this year, they're going to start to give some, some direction. We're really, really believing to have them here, have them here in Melbourne in the next month. We're going to get them here by the end of February. And so can you pray for that? Pray that we get the right, the right stuff with the government, all the things that stop. We have the money to do it. It's just now we need to... We now need the right whatever, you know, to get them here. And so they'll be staying, hopefully for a month, they'll be with us and you get to meet all around Connor and, and Job and, and, and little Grace. It's funny, you know, Job, he's a, he's a lovely little boy, he, like, but he's one of those kids, just, just a handful, you know. One of those kids, a little boy. And, and when I was over there, um, we all went out, and, like, just before I left, we all went out to this kind of this festival up the street. And, and he wanted to come, and I thought, oh, he's going to create issues, you know, because he's just. He just gets in trouble, you know. Anyway, and I said to him in the car, I said, he's, he's really good because he speaks Thai, speaks English, speaks Burmese. He's, he's an amazing little boy, you know. And, and I said, Joe, you need to hold your mother's hand all, all day because I, you need to be good. And I said, you, you're listening to me? And he said, yeah. And so we got, we got there and he grabbed my hand and he held my hand for an hour. And he walked around this whole bed holding my hand. And I thought, man, that's, it was so cool, you know. And I thought, He's really growing up, he's really starting to mature. So you get to meet him and Grace, hopefully in the next little while. But we believe this is going to be a year, a really a, a year of new things. And, and you're going to find when you get to meet around Connor, they're really developing the heartbeat of this house. They just love the poor. They really want to work in that whole area of the poor and the, the disadvantaged. And it's just so great, you know. So I've put a video together, I just filmed it while I was over there, kind of, and I've attempted to put some... This has been our 11th year, I think, here at our, our base, and we've just had our graduation. This year, we have had two new leaders, Orain and Konu. Hi. That's them here. Hi. So, Orain, tell us about you leading the base this year. What has it meant for you? Uh, for me, it means uh, I became 
to learn uh, more about Jesus. He leads his people with his humble and his power and his authority. So I learn more in authority and I have learned more humility in so leadership. Learned many lessons. So, yeah, yeah, because more becoming a more servant leader. <laughs> Yeah, that was uh, really exciting and when you let me lead and when you wash my feet that was I feel like it's you know, very wow so awesome amazing I can't explain no That's great. yeah I have no words I'm really enjoying my leadership and thank you you and my uh, you and Pastor Sue and your church people also mm. thank well, you for trusting me also what about you Connor about this? appreciate yeah. She never expecting God let us go like a one level to second level always. We never stand in one level. God make us to more stronger in every level. Wow. Kanu mm. has learned, uh, we usually think most of the ministers or most of the, like uh, someone who work for God, they are not really man of God that we think of woman of God we, we thought before so when she started lead, uh, with with me together she she more began to know people are uh, there was like us they have so many things behind them so so we we began to know more like a discernment of their spirit and discernment of their life so that is she really mm. feel very different I mean in fact God gave you a, a, a bit of a vision when we started this year, mm -hmm. didn't He? Yes. Tell us a little bit about that vision. It was, it was so exciting. Okay. Uh, yeah, the first of all, the vision was when we start this LTC 2017 July. Yes. That was time we, uh, as a staff and Magasu, there also first time. We we hang together and we pray. And so we we everybody know when we are doing together in his ministry or everywhere. We need to be in unity and we need to love one another. So, uh, and also God went to show me also by His presence. Okay. Uh, why we are praying after we when we are gathering together and when we close our eyes together, that time she saw the thousand of angel clapping, like a cheering for us together. We will start this year, when the beginning. Wow, so powerful. Mm. And just the other day at our graduation, mm. you had another vision. Mm. Tell us about that one. Yes. <laughs> Mm, I want to share the second thing also how God cheerful with us again and of the years this 2017 while we are doing while we start before we start doing worship time right there was that while we're singing Second, uh, second, uh, the vision was she saw thousands of angels and like a other a lot of angels was clapping. Uh, one of the 
uh, leader, like a, she think that was maybe Jesus. Uh, that that man was stood up and give crown. No? She she saw us a leader, you know, like we have like a lot of stuff here, right? But not including Maria Mary. So she's so sad. Why they not be with our team? They not have that crown. So she only saw here promised leader and with you and Pastor Sue. Okay. So you saw them giving crowns to each of the staff. Wow. Mm. That's so powerful. <laughs> God's so good. So it's, tell us something else that's happened for you this year. Like God has really stretched you. It's been a wonderful time. Just tell us another thing that's been really important for you. <laughs> When, when you guys let me lead uh, this place with my family together and you trust in us, that was really uh, so much for us. We really uh, appreciate that. And I feel more freedom in his kingdom. I can work more freedom because uh, you guys are not controlling. You guys are just like a release. You are like a, your ministry and release your power to us. So she really happy and so enjoyful work with you guys together. Mm -hmm. And so thank you so much for your uh, church member and your family support us. And we really appreciate that. We are really thank you. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. So is there any, any final words? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And also, I want to ask you guys to keep uh, continuous in as a God family. We really need to hear God's voice always. Without God's word or without God's vision, we cannot continue His ministry. You know? Because uh, please keep praying for us and I really uh, want to see more about God's vision and dream. Amen. So let's work together. <laughs> Amen. That's so exciting. So thanks, guys. Um, so uh, thank you. It's been a real honour to to be with these <laughs> these guys this year, and uh, we want to encourage you. We're going to continue to believe to bring Orain and Kanu to Australia soon, and we want you to support that. And so thanks. God bless you. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. We'll come in and see you, you soon. <laughs>